Okay, so like the rule with your hair is you have to definitely go um, like 320 days without washing it. And that's the trick to like the perfect messy bun. Here I am in my bathroom and you're fixing to get ready with me and my toddler and this is what's realistically like getting ready as a mom. So let's do it. So first things first, you absolutely have to have one of these. You definitely have to put it on like so. You know, got to hold your hair back, okay? I know you gotta wash your face before you get started, all right? Okay, hold on baby, I'm washing my face. And you have to do it like those commercials. Cause that, that makes the, the day go by just better. Okay, so now, um, once your face is washed, you gotta moisturize. Okay, apparently, uh, they say, you gotta like really blend in a moisturizer, and apparently you gotta go up to your face with the moisturizer because if you go down, it causes a double chin, but I already got one, so. So Noah already wants my makeup, so I'll just go ahead and give him this. You always wanna make sure that you start off with a clean workspace. Super clean, super organized, so that you can get to everything really quickly. And since I already have a crying baby, shocker, I'm gonna go ahead and just take my makeup and put it in the living room floor, like I always do. Okay. Is that what we do first? We'll do this first, okay, all right. And Noah just broke this yesterday, so literally all the powder fell out into my bathroom floor, so today, we don't have powder, that just makes it better. But uh, they say you start with eyeshadow, but uh, not me. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with some concealer and we're just gonna do a little bit of that, do a little bit of that on that. And I've got some acne there and there and there. I wonder what that's from like all over so I should have just went ahead and just put foundation all over but uh, I'll do that next and then um, you take a brush and you just kind of blend it all blend it all in you know what I mean okay. I mean I'm sure you know what I mean because if you're really still watching this video you're not watching to get ready <laughs> okay. so uh, blender blend 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 Speed this up and put it in the uh, bathroom. Go! 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 It's like the faster that you do it all, the better because um, usually you don't get to finish your makeup anyways if you're a mom. Uh, do y'all feel me on that? Okay, so now. We're gonna go ahead and do some foundation. Double wear foundation. And Noah's helping for sure. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pour a little bit of that on my hand like that. And just, we also just, uh, you know, we can't really get too close to the mirror because Noah cries. So I just look up every now and then. Don't touch. And then um, just uh, hope that for the best because uh, no one really ever tells me when my makeup looks bad. I just noticed like at the end of the day like I have a line and I didn't really blend good. But uh, I feel like no one tells me because that's like motherhood um, and everyone goes through that sometimes, right? I don't know. But it's really going to be great today because I don't have any um, powder. So that's even better. But oh. If you, if you blend it down your neck, um, less chance to have a line, so you just like, and the brush I'm using is um, by IT uh, Cosmetics. I got it at Ulta, and it's the Airbrush Smoothing Foundation. So, you just do that. Oh, you put, make sure you put it like on your eye, like really good. 
because we got them bags, right? Okay. So then the next thing that I always do um, no. is definitely my eyebrows because I just started no. just started doing that. And I got this in my FabFitFun box. Um, yeah, I don't know what it is. Winky Lux. That's what this is. So I know most people. I'm not. Most people like I'm to. Not. Uh, I'm not. Most people like no. to no. brush their brows out no. first, but I'm just going no. for it. No. Yeah. Okay. No. And I don't have a mirror too close because if I get too close, Noah likes to freak out. So I'm just winging it here. That, that, yep, looks great. Now let's uh, try this other side. Okay, yes, good, great girl. Those brows are good. So I got my brows done. And then I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put some highlighter. I also got this in a FabFitFun box like years ago. So I'm just gonna put some highlighter on like right here. Yeah, that's good. Right here. See, like the faster you work, the better because um, he doesn't always let me finish, so. Um, then what else? Oh, sometimes we prime if we're like really feeling ourselves, but uh, we had to skip that step today, so. Um, then usually I put on some powder, but uh, that broke, so I'm just gonna like do this to like in case the other stuff didn't blend. Oh, yeah, that's good. And then I'm gonna go ahead and put on some uh, some bronzer. It's the Too Faced bronzer. And if you guys haven't tried this, but like for real, it's good. Okay. And since I don't have powder, I'm just gonna like pretend like I'm really tan today, like I'm a Guido or Guidette. And just like make, that way I'm not like shiny from the, uh, foundation and then I like put some up here and then like blend down my neck yes I know I had so many people ask like how I get ready for the day every day so I just wanted you guys to like know how it is and then like once I get done with uh see I have to I have to hunt down everything because he uh he likes to get everything so I never know where anything is. And this is MAC uh, blush. I have it, have had it for so long you can't really see what it says on the back. Blush baby. I don't know. Anyways. And I'm just like, mm, I'm gonna blend that in a little bit. Um, and then I go back with this brush because I want to make sure that I don't have like too much everywhere. So I just like do this. Okay, so um, the most important thing is the foundation and uh, I already got it done. So now I'm just gonna go ahead with uh, this eyeshadow brush that I also got from It Cosmetics. He's getting my primer all over the place. So, yeah. yep, that's really good. I love that. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this yeah. palette and he's already, he's getting impatient. So we're just gonna like try to make sure Baby, that is low. That's expensive. We can't. We can't play with that. And then you end up just like giving it to him and saying ruin it because I just like need to get ready. Kind of just go like get the lightest brown color and just like go like this in the corner on both sides. And then I go back with my highlighter with my finger. And I just try to blend it. And you guys like think this is a joke probably, but this is literally my routine and how I get ready for the day. And um, it's not anything fancy. So that's why I wanted to show you. Cause I wanted you guys to realize that this is like real life motherhood. And um, this is how I make it happen in the daytime whenever he's awake. But now we have Oh, and then I go like underneath my line with the eyeshadow brush. Good, and then 
Now if I'm really feeling myself and feeling like I have time for the day, then I'll put on some uh, liquid eyeliner, but that's usually only if he's like still, if he's like napping or something, but uh, clearly <laughs> he's not, so. Um, my next step is probably mascara. And uh, since I'm super organized here, I'm sure I can just find it real quick. And then you just, you hope you can get done with your mascara by the time he's like done uh, playing with whatever you handed him. Money. Oh, you want money? Me too. Are you saying mom's makeup is worth a lot of money? Because that's true too. But I know you guys have like really been asking for me to show you how I get ready and like what products I use. So I thought I would just go ahead and show you really quick in today's video. Cause this is like super well put together and thought out. So um, sometimes like if you're really tired, um, I use this Tula and I just like go underneath here and like make it like a little shiny because like you can't really tell I'm that tired if it's like shiny under there. And like no one really sees me anyway and like you kind of get mascara under there too, that's fine. Um, again, no one's gonna tell you if your makeup looks bad because uh, you're a new mom, so. Um, this is like, this is my makeup. So now you just like go for some, some lips and I usually do the 24 hour super stay by Maybelline. It is, it literally is my favorite. I really like it a lot, but um, I usually get one that's like just my lip color. But today I'm just gonna go ahead and use this gloss. It is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost in the color Ballet Pink. And it just basically puts a gloss of your lips. Oh, oh, you're gonna floss, okay. Yes, you can do that. So, um, I think everything turned out pretty uh, perfect. Um, we won't talk about whatever that is or like what's under these eyes. Like really what's going on there. I gotta fix that for sure. But um, so now on to the hair. All my fancy makeup is like definitely taken care of right now. So I'm just gonna go ahead and leave him here with it and um, let's go do my hair really quick. Okay, so like the rule with your hair is you have to definitely go um, like 320 days without washing it. And that's the trick to like the perfect messy bun. And if you think that you need to wash it, it looks like this. Uh, think again, cause you can just use a whole can of some cheap dry shampoo and you just like, And like where that spot was really bad, you just put extra. Yeah, you just like to, you just gotta like really get in there with that dry shampoo so that people don't know that you haven't bathed in seven days. Okay, and then like once you spray the dry shampoo in there, uh, this is how you know like it's good if your hair is turning gray. So that's how you know if you got enough in there. And then you just turn your head upside down. <laughs> And if you can find a brush, uh, you can definitely brush it out if, if you need to, if it's really tangly. But yeah, you just brush it out. That way no one knows, again, that it's been seven days since you've taken a bath, so. Um, and then I just like flip, I flip my hair upside down. When you've gone 320 days without, uh, without washing your hair, you definitely have to make sure that uh, you get that good bun on top. And 
You pray that your last hair tie doesn't break. Okay, so we got the messy bun. Uh, it's a little, it's a little messy, messier than I would like, but I think that's even more perfect for uh, my life because uh, clearly I like to pull some hair out so it's not like slicked down to my head and it looks even more dirty. And I just brush out some of these little baby hairs and sideburns. So this is my makeup and now I'm going to get dressed for the day. And I definitely, I definitely get really dressed up on a normal day and I put on some uh, jeans and stuff. And I definitely, most definitely do not put on leggings after I took off the leggings that I wore yesterday. I, I definitely don't do that. And uh, I definitely don't put on a wrinkled t-shirt. Definitely not, like never. So that is my super motivational get ready with me with my toddler, how motherhood really is. You guys, this is what I was talking about when I said my channel was taking a shift. I'm gonna show the funny, lighthearted side of motherhood, but the real side and just laugh about it with you guys. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. No, gonna be your love.